Okay, I don't have a job number to this. I just got it this morning when I was out on the road. Uh, it's from Jennifer Hansen at Yates Wood and McDonald. This is called Montclair Townhomes. This is in Edmonds. We've been out to this property before. All she wants us to do is some striping out here. She wants us to repaint the unit numbers that are on the curbing around the property here. So when you go around the circle on both sides, there are unit numbers on the curbs. The, the actual unit numbers have letters and numbers and they're four inches. And then they're, they're painted yellow. And in the background of it, there are black boxes. So we need to repaint the black boxes on the curb. And then we need to put the four inch letters and numbers on there. So there's 31 sets of black boxes to do. There are 124 digits that are four inch letters and numbers on each curb. The gate code is 5001. And um, when you come in here, I just wanna show you what it looks like. So you got a black box on the curb. So a rectangular in shape. And then you've got one letter and then the house number. So A104, A105. Then you've got others that say B, C, D. You might have G and F. So we need to have, make sure that we've got four inch letters with us. Uh, so a four inch alphabet. And then we need four inch numbers. That's it. I'd be two guys. Um, <clears throat> might as well throw in. It's not going to take a five gallon bucket of paint, but it's probably going to be around two, two gallons of black paint, uh, maybe three, just at the most. I'm thinking it's probably only about two. So a couple gallons of black, and then uh, you're only going to need about maybe three gallons of yellow at the most. I think I'm, I'm like way over shooting that, but uh, that should be it. Two man job. Any other questions, let me know.